To improve this rhythm of the shoulder blade and the arm, we left out an important component, which was all of the other components that have to line up to do it right. Here's what that means. In conjunction with you improving upon this down and back shoulder, you've got to get these hips in position like we practice. Find that pelvic neutral position, lock the core down in place, pull the chin tucked, super tucked like that. You're going to see a 90 degree angle right here of the lower leg and the thigh. The glute is firing in the right. And now, Marisol, come on, pan over this way. Now what you're going to do is one half the speed that you think you're going to go. You're going to work to slowly press up. And as this presses up, that shoulder blade pulls down. As the arm presses up, the shoulder blade pulls down. It's counter force. It's called scapulohumeral rhythm for you nerds out there. Nerds. Nerds.